Hi, I'm Kim, and this is my review of the new Zero Shoes Prio Neo. First things first, these shoes were sent to me free of charge from Zero Shoes for me to review them. The Zero Shoes Prio Neo is a near perfect barefoot style running shoe. They offer all the usual Zero Shoes features, white toe box, zero drop, flat flexible sole, no art support, very thin, lightweight and flexible. Now it's called the Prio Neo and it's very similar to the original Prio. This is my own old Prio that I purchased for my own money and I've used this a lot, both for running and for casual. And that's actually the thing I had with this shoe is it performs like a running shoe or an athletic shoe at least, but it doesn't look like one. This one do. This you have no doubt is a training shoe or a running shoe or a athletic shoe. The upper here is a dual layer mesh and the fit and the finish of it looks very much like a running shoe. Where this looks like a, I don't know, casual shoe. The issue I've had with the, this as well is it looks a little bit clunky to me. It looks a little too built up. Where well, this has a much more sleek um, design to it, even though when I measure it, it actually is a few grams heavier than the original. In terms of weight, I weighed in my pair of 44s at 276 grams. That's, that's not a super light shoe. It's not a heavy shoe either, but it's, it's not light and it's not light compared to many other barefoot style shoes. But it doesn't matter because when I have them on my feet, they don't feel heavy. They don't feel clunky. They've actually, I don't even notice I have them on my feet. If you want your Prios to have even more proprioception and an even wider toe box, you can take out the insole. It's thin and flexible, no art support, no anything. And the shoe gets lighter, roomier and thinner. Personally, I run with the insole in because I run trails and it gives me just this little bit of support. This is not a trail shoe. You can see that on the tread pattern. This is a road shoe, but for light trails, it definitely works fine. Well, it's not the most beautiful pair of shoes I've ever seen. They're not ugly, but it's not a design shoe. It's not a great looking shoe. It's an okay looking shoe, but it's not great. These shoes are obviously quite new, even though they are quite dirty from my last run. But in terms of durability, I have no idea yet, but they feel like they can last a long time, both in the upper and the usual zero shoes outsole that lasts forever. The only issue I have is right over here. And I can show you on my old shoes, my old Prios, because they actually loosened up here. And that is because I sometimes take off my shoes like this because I'm lazy. I learned this the hard way. Don't do that on a zero shoe. I haven't seen any issues with that on the new shoes, but that is also because both they are new and I learned from my mistakes. Other than that, there's not much to say about the new Prio Neo, because it's just a running shoe as you want it to be. It's just a slap of rubber and a nice, comfortable upper. I think the upper will serve me much better when it comes to spring and summer than the original Prios that tend to be a little warm. So as a summer running shoe and as a running shoe in general for road and light trail, this might be the near perfect running shoe. It's gonna be my go-to shoe this summer.